So I'm with the winner of Australia's Got Talent 2018. <laughs> <laughs> yes, crazy. Vision. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Thank and you so much. Congratulations. Thank you. How do you feel right now? Oh, I words can't describe it. I feel incredible. I, I never thought I'd make it this far. And thanks to Australia and you three. Oh, God. Yeah. Why didn't you think you would make it this far? Uh, I don't know. I've never experienced anything like this, and I don't think that many people get to, so... Is the confidence level different just pre-walking out and performing to when you're performing? Yeah, well, I get more nervous when I'm just about to perform, but when I'm actually just on the stage singing, the nerves go away and I just have fun. You're in the moment. Yeah. And when did you start singing? About six, I think. And when did yeah. you know that that was what you wanted to do? The minute you started? Pretty much, yeah. The minute I started, I mean, I had all these things go go through my mind, like I want to be a chef and stuff like that. But then when I when I was in my <laughs> don't do that. Um, but yeah, when I was about ten, probably I sort of said, okay, this is what I want to do. And yeah. and how did that work? Like with um, your parents, did they take you to singing lessons. Yeah, yeah, they did, and I've been having singing lessons for about four years now. And yeah, but really well. did, you must have sung pretty much like this when you started. Oh, I don't know. I mean, when I'm young, it's always very squeaky, <laughs> but yeah. And do you think that your voice range will stay as big as it is? Like, do you know how many octaves that you sing? I've got about four octaves. That's incredible. <laughs> Thank you. Do you think you'll keep that as you get older? Do you think you'll be able to maintain that? I'd love to. If I have the right training, I think I can, but um, I think I'll definitely get some more low notes because I am still growing and getting yeah. older. Yeah, I so it could to, expand. It could expand. That would be great. <laughs> I'd like the more I carry range. <laughs> well, the high notes are spectacular, but oh, yeah, I, I guess the thing that I always think about when I hear someone like you sing is that you need special songs written, yeah. so it takes the range of your voice. Yeah. Um, so you wrote an amazing song Thank for you. this show. Um, you did all of the lyrics, and yeah. it was about your experience of coming on the show. Yeah. Have you written? Tons more songs? Are they uh, no, sitting there waiting? I haven't written that many songs. I've written a few, but that was really special to me. That song that's even in the bridge in the fast bit, it's about my mum and how she used to sing to me, Minnie Ripperton's Loving You. And yeah, it's, it means a lot to me, that song. It, it's, it's a very, very special song. Every time it gets to the end, I just think, I want to hear that again straight <laughs> Thank away. You very much. I really hope that you get to do uh, a lot more songwriting. Is there anyone that you would want to write songs with? Do you have any? idols or any songwriters? Um, the ultimate thing would be to um, sing with Aretha Franklin. Um, and David Foster, I hear, is, is very good. And yeah. yeah, all those people, sort of people. But with famous singers and stuff like that, Beyonce would also be good. And oh, oh, can you shake it then? Can you do that? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, good, because we didn't really get to see you. No, dance not really on dance. Stage. Yeah. I felt like sort of busting a move with everybody shuffling with the opener, but. But oh, that's good. You've always got to leave them, yeah. you know, wanting a exactly. bit more, and you know, you've got surprises <laughs> yeah. up your sleeve. So, what is what would be the ultimate dream? I'm trying to imagine. You know, I'm 14 years old. I've mm -hmm. just won a competition that's been the biggest TV show in the country. Yes. What What's your big dream? What's the goal? Big dream would to probably get an award at the Grammys and sing at the Grammys. That'd be great. <laughs> Let's shake on that. Let's yes. see it happen. Well, I. Thank you for coming on our show. You've been absolutely so incredible. It's been a good bunch of people this year. It has. And uh, I hope that one day we do see you at the Grammys, you know, <laughs> with songs that you have penned yeah. for yourself. So <laughs> just keep great. writing down, keep writing down. And remember my words of advice that I gave you I um, a few weeks ago, which was always take the opportunity to take the toilet break before you walk out on stage. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Congratulations. Thank you so much, Danny. See you out there. Thank you. Yeah.